bulletproof with those eyes yeah. all my attention's on you it's the little things it's the little things but i'm tired of acting like i'm not hopeless show me where your heart is i'm hoping you can say the word until I need to be ready to leave my house so it's gonna be a bit of a rushed one but I don't need to do a lot of things to get ready today so I'm just going to put on a little bit of mascara today I don't actually usually wear makeup but I am having a photo taken in Copenhagen today so I want to wear makeup <laughs> for that so I'm going to Copenhagen today to run a few errands for a visa that I've been applying for and I need to go and get like a health checkup and do an x-ray and I don't really know why but for some reason when I apply for visas around the world they just always want to check up on me and see if if I'm sick or if I'm pregnant or if I'm I don't even know what they're checking anymore but they really enjoy bringing me in for a health checkup so i'm doing that today i'm also meeting up with my friend viola we are going to go for dinner when she's done with school and i'm done with all these checkups and it's gonna be awesome so the visa that i'm applying for is one for australia i live about three hours away from copenhagen so i'm taking the train and I'm gonna have to wear a mask because that's mandatory in public transportation here in Denmark now. So I'm not really looking forward to wearing a mask for three hours, but I suppose we gotta do what we gotta do. Yeah, I understand why we're doing it. I just don't necessarily agree with it, you know? Meeting up with Viola. I've actually only met her once before. We had so much fun. She's one of my friends from Breakaway Movement which is um the community that i work with online last time we met it was just so much fun and like everything was just clicking you know those kind of friends where you just meet them first time and it just clicks i might just bring you along so you can get to meet her <laughs> I have my first day on my period today and the pain is kind of a lot but I also use magnesium oil on my belly and it really helps a lot and then I do a lot of deep belly breathing just like very deep <laughs> belly breathing and honestly that is probably the thing that helps the most it just has to be like a consistent thing and I have to be aware of it all day 
And then I find that sometimes coffee makes the pains worse. I'm still on the coffee today, so we'll see what happens. A couple of years ago when I had my periods, I would just like hate, hate it so much and just be super annoyed with it and super like blaming of my body. I would be ashamed a little bit. I would feel like gross and just ugh. I was just like, no, I don't want this. But now it's like, I have a whole different perspective on it. I actually had my hormonal birth control just like removed from my life because I wanted to be able to like find my own cycle, if that makes sense. I think it makes sense for some of you and some of you are probably like, what the hell? <laughs> but <laughs> I wanted to have my own cycle and allow my body to find its own rhythm because our bodies are so fucking intelligent and like they know exactly what's up. They know exactly like how to regulate themselves and oh, come here. Baby. Hi. Come, come. Ooh, baby. <laughs> that was nice. Our bodies know exactly like how to regulate themselves and how to like work themselves out. I'm just grateful now on the first day of my period, even though it hurts like a mother. <laughs> I'm grateful because I know that I'm tapped in, tuned in, turned on. And honestly, on my first day of my period, I feel so good. Like emotionally and spiritually, I feel so tapped in. So tapped in. Comment down below if you think I'm weird as hell or if you agree. Now let's get dressed. This is the outfit for the day. Never been the type for giving up. Complicated situations only make it worse. Cause just get it started, it's not enough. I'll be around when you need me, promise. I won't be only even on my worst days. My worst days. 2 a.m. I shift face. Tripping off something that you got, yeah. I would never listen to my work conversation run out on you. Sometimes nothing I can say to you could change up your mind. I'll get on your nerves and then we'll fight. Give you all the space you need in on those nights. Yeah, even on your worst days, your worst days. When you get in my 